For many, the landscape around Palmer in South Australia is barren and empty. But for artist Greg Johns, it's one huge outdoor gallery. I'm a sculptor, been a sculptor now for uh, 32 years. I make large sculptures. Uh, I guess one thing that's really interested me since about 1990 is attempting to make sculpture that feels like it comes out of this place. I'm not a big fan of this notion of what's called international work, where everything looks the same. I want to make work that comes out of this place. And I think I'm making steps in the right direction there. Steel would be the main medium I use, Corten steel, which ages up to a rusty sort of ochre colour. It's a steel that I think reflects the colours we get in the Australian landscape quite clearly as well, and that's one reason I've used it rather than bronze. I don't think the Australian landscape is actually that degraded or that barren. I, I think that's a perception of incoming culture into this place. When you start to look at the detail of the place, there's actually an immense amount to look at. Wonderful, huge blue skies and horizon lines that are a few hundred kilometres distant. It's a really dramatic setting to, to place the works in. They silhouette against the sky in really dramatic sort of fashion. It highlights the sculpture, and I was aware of that from the beginning, that this was simply a, a dramatic place in which to place my work. Within the sculpture, I think there's influences both from incoming uh, culture, but there's also local influences in the work, and I really tried to push the two together and come up with a, a, perhaps a third sort of way of looking at things. I'm not trying to become Aboriginal in a way. I mean, I think it's just a silly thing to do. I, I think that hybridising of views about sculpture from Europe, together with an understanding of this place before European arrival, and, and indeed what Aboriginal culture had to offer, I think you put all that together and you've got a really exciting mix. I think I am happy with the way the work's developed and what's occurred. I don't think I've played it really safe. And I think the work's saying something a bit different and it's exploring this place to some extent. I think to be a sculptor here at this point in time is actually the best place to be, really, in the world. Mm -hmm.